All right, so, oh, hello, by the way, my bad. How are y'all doing? Um, I'm running back uh, day five again, four. I'm running day four again because the record something something went wrong with the recording so hopefully this one won't be so bad uh basically what's gonna happen here i'm gonna end up fighting a, uh okay Because I did this twice already, so I'm just going to kind of like speed through it just so I can show you guys uh, what happens. So basically, I come here. I uh, throw a couple of Pikmins up there. Throw her up there. And I throw a couple, couple of Pikmins up here. Swap her. Oh! Alright, never mind then. Wait, do I not get to fight the boss again? Let me see. Because you fight a boss on this level, and I'm just running through it till I can, so I can show you guys who that boss is. So that way no one's left out of anything. So, let's see, well if the fruit's not there, I don't think the boss will be there again. Let me check. So I thought it would be there. Yep, he's not gonna be here. Alright, well, I'll be right back. Be a fruit over here. So they're gonna go deliver that, and then I'm about to show you the boss that I fought like twice. Should be easy though, hopefully. As you know me, I'm a professional gamer. I know exactly what I'm doing. What are they doing? I didn't ask him to go through that water. Yeah, you lost some of your people. I just lost a couple.
and then they find this thing. Belongs to Captain Olimar. See, because I never played... I mean, I played the first Pikmin. And I don't know if that one had Olimar in it. But... Um, I didn't play Pikmin 2. So me picking a Pikmin 3 is kind of just like... Oh shit, what happened? Is there a... Is there like a, you know... A, if they're connected. So I don't really know. Centipede looking thing. It's too damn big. I wonder why it has a gap in its, like, you know. In its, like, mouth. like tips on how to beat this thing to make it short you just break its outer shell and then attack its inner shell the rock pikmin breaks, breaks its shell and the red pikmin do the damage i guess you don't have to you don't have to necessarily break its head because it does i think it does the same amount of damage Regardless on where it, where it's thrown, you just gotta break its its shell. Cause I I felt like I had a harder time breaking its face when I did the same amount of damage if I were to throw him on like you know the butt of his tail. He coughs up a fucking phone that's from like two like 1990, maybe early, like late 80s maybe. Oh, shit. <laughs> Throw a couple in there. Another tip. See? Break a shell, attack its inner parts. I wonder what other Pikmin I get to get on here. Because I don't know if exploding Pikmin are a thing. Because that'd be kind of cool. But kind of weird. Like, will they come back? Or are they just gone? <laughs> so, I don't know. Obviously, the yellow Pikmin are going to be like, I guess, immune to lightning? Electricity? Maybe? Question mark? Shit. Well, while they go do that, I can go explore. 
ho hopefully find some more fruit and then get some more rock pikmin whoops Strawberry over here. Oh, yeah, and the map helps tremendously. And, and there's nothing else over here. Oh, so I can break that cinder block. I'll show you what I mean. Cause there's 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 this wall I didn't think I could break. I'm gonna see if I can break it with a rock pick, man. I doubt it. But let's see. Not that wall. Oh. That wall. What am I getting? That's from the cell phone. Yeah. The 1990s cell phone. See, it tells me that the, it starts spitting out seeds because it's full. So I can only have a hundred Pikmin on the field. While the rest can stay inside the... the Better make sure I go get Brittany because I don't want to leave her on this planet. <laughs> I wonder what happens. Will it be game over? I don't want to find out. I really don't. Because I've gotten too many game overs on games that I shouldn't be doing, but I do them anyways. So. Can I break this door? Yeah, no, that's a big no then. Alright. Well that's that's that. Basically like a short sum of, of what happened. And I think I could end it early, yeah. And red to earlier day? No, no. End day then. Yeah, okay, cool. So there is an option to end the day early, which is awesome. <sighs> I am tired. I like how the onion looks though, because it's like a... Have you guys ever had the Trix yogurt back in like middle school? Where they got the, the strawberry and the um, blueberry mixes, you gotta swirl it together. I actually met someone who actually ate one side separately. It was weird, but I usually like stirred mine and then ate it. Poor rabbit. He'll never get the taste of tricks. Get the new zest zest bomb. Was it called this bro? I guess what it was called something else. And then the dragon fruit. Again, I never had it. 
I hear people say it smells horrible, but I have never cut one or ate one. I had a papaya. Those are pretty good. And then I got a little bit left over. Man, I'm not gonna lie, it made me kind of nervous because it was just all like all those empty spaces and you only got but so much like fruit and so I got kind of scared because it's all like oh shit because I started off from like two then I got six so I don't know we'll see how this goes what if I can get more onions you recover the communication device that was inside the Armored Maw Dad. That's what it's called. And then Alf is gonna work on the thingy. Yes, for the third time. <laughs> third time's the charm, right? Let's see. All right. Well, I'm gonna end this here. Um, I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.